Good day and welcome back to Super Mario Brothers 2. This time my voice should be more presentable and better in every single way. And imminent failure, as per always. I've had to make it, redo everything I did in the last episode because it didn't save. It just didn't save. And that meant a bit of struggling with Mauser again, obviously, which is quite a shame. So I'm going to continue on and it's as if nothing happened. There are warp zones and if you do that, but I forget where they are. Red cabbage. There we go, just pointless. We killed him there. Quick sand that is flowing very slowly. Oh dear. Just going to sneak into here. Just a few bombs just so you could explode that, but what's the point? Very nice cool aid. Yeah, I should I should just stop talking. I couldn't even reach. But we did it. Now, I haven't really made clear what I'm going to be doing after this. So my brother's fair, that's uh, That'd be a logical step forward. And then, we'll, we'll do incorporate some wrong packs as Force of Money Worlds in that time between this and then. Nice bit of variety and what the hell am I doing? There, are, there are two. I've said this before. There are two jump buttons and they're bound next to each other and can't be crazy. But it's as if they flip every once in a while. Oh, combo! I did say in the last episode that a lot of enemies didn't return and I was in the incorrect mindset because bogeys, bob -ombs, as we just saw that they returned a lot as well. And we've got another one of the sections, we never really struggled with this last time. This time things are a lot worse. It's narrow. Look how narrow this is. He shouldn't give us too much trouble. We don't need the cherries. We don't need the star. I mean, I've got confidence in my abilities here. It's just going to leap up and down. Look at the progress we are making. He is going to get rid of our progress. I just know it. Yep, he, he is. He will. And use our master strafes. Why? Just why? This section is not even difficult. Yeah, that happens a lot. Let's make some in it. That didn't happen. I am very surprised by that. If you're still watching this, again, thank you. Pointing up the failure is a very, very nice quality to have. Okay, we're going to try raw speed. If the enemies get too far away, they will despawn, but that's not going to happen for a while. Oh, 
hopefully there'll be no more failure, we're just gonna spam it, just gonna spam the button. It's working fine for now. Gonna let them all fall that way. Apart from that him, because he's, cause he's smart. And we did it again. We need to safely dispose of him there. They're just going to continually walk here forever. Be able to do this. Right, oh good, the sniff it despawned. Oh no, he just he just he's just further down. That'd be too good if that was actually true. This may not end well. Yeah. Strong possibility that this is not going to end well. Okay, and we are back. I had to take a business phone call. Let's just call it that. <laughs> Still here. Essentially, in a different take, I reloaded the previous state. That starts completely with me. I doubt there'll be any more of those. So I'll jump cuts in my videos for now. The heavily edited, edited days. They are over, aren't they? For now. Yeah, most likely for a long time. As I said before in the previous series, they're not they're not coming back. For good reason, because sometimes I look at them and think, oh that's good. Sometimes I look at them and think, oh that's absolutely terrible. Why did I ever think that was good? It varies. Run! That's what we need to do. Run! Spam! I don't care if we got hit! I don't care! We did it! We almost got hit by a bullet that was fell, but we did it! And now it's everyone's favourite Red Birdo! Yay! <laughs> wow! Wow! So okay, that's not that is not going to happen. I would just let Birdo defeat me just so I could feel good about myself. There we go. gonna carry this. There we go, we can still fit through that. And that happened again. Beautiful pointless mini game. Well two free. We've suffered enough. Now it's nice and bright and Bezo or shy away just click through. Just sand. Who needs an extra mushroom more alive when we've got cherries and coins? But now we've just got coins. And there are the cherries. Now, oh well, look. Palette differentiation. Oh, I was stuck. I was stuck. In my defence, I was completely stuck. I forget what's in here. Ah, oh, of course, it's just, it's just cabbage. Waste it by just lobbing it over here. And we can't even get anything. I can only take a one hit. I can't even try and land on one. Oh, wait, oh, so close. 
so far. It's a lot harder than it actually looks! It's quite easy to die as well, surprisingly. Yeah, that's how we do it. Okay, so let's remember none of that happened. Gonna do it is use raw speed, that is not Mario's strong point. Wait. The power of editing brought me back here because why not? Apologize for the jump cuts, this won't be in episodes subsequently, I hope. Keep going disturbed, it's not good. Come to some progress. Got all the cherries where I get. Quite pointless, I know. It's gonna save this power block. Yeah, look at that. Now! One of our favourite sections of the game. That we are very, very good at, and we never struggle on. Let's keep digging. Dig for victory. Add to the star and collect the cherries could be useful if it would reach a usable place, which it never does. Oh, ah, not alternating paths again. We all remember what happened last time. There's always, there's always one. We're gonna do our massive super jump, that spike flip in the remix. And now the hard part. Transport this key all the way up. Well, not getting attacked, as you just saw there. This time we actually can take more hits. You can always fill the key if we need to. We've almost done it, we've almost done it. And he missed. We have done it. There we go, very tactical decision of me to make that. What's in here, a bomb? Now just a power block for some reason. Actually it is quite helpful here. Now we all saw the failure that I... Well... <laughs> Hi, Clyde time. I'd say he's a lot, lot easier than Mouser, but then again, I'm just an idiot, so. As we just proved there. Relatively easy boss that I just failed to just defeat because of my incompetence. And it's the beautiful bonus game that never works. World free. This time we've got a beautiful seizure waterfall. I know it's terrible. 
And on some Mega Man games it's even worse than waterfalls are in background. Haven't seen this guy in a long time, we're just gonna hijack his magic carpet again. Malbezos trying to stab us with their tridents of death. This time we've got a grey panzer. Just gonna throw it. And he's, and he's done. He's dead. Yeah, surprisingly doing well. He says and traps himself in here. Gonna have to take him out again. We've got the munitions to do so. Oh, he's, oh, he's quite eager. Time for Red Birdo again. And time to die again. It's gonna mix it up with a fireball. Or oh, whatever that is meant to be. I'll just say fire. That was a moral victory, is what that was. Come on, Birdo. I'm ready for you this time. May not look... Yeah, it doesn't look like it, does it? This time, Birdo is going to die. And this time we also haven't learned our lesson, never grab the first one. There we go, was that really so difficult? Well, with me apparently it is. <laughs> we can't even make the jump. I'll just spam it. Didn't work. Let's try and be tactical here. I'm just doing it really fast. And that happened. Well, with World 3 2 as our next death place, presumably, I will leave here. Have a good day. And goodbye.